After the entry into application of the Transparency Regulation in March 2021, the submission of the dossiers for the main applications domains will be done through two different tools. Pesticides dossiers will be submitted through Euclid, all other dossiers will be submitted through FSCAP. Euclid and FSCAP will make the e-submission of application dossiers easier. Let's discover the main functionalities of both tools, starting from Euclid. After you have defined your mixture composition in Euclid, you can access the substance dataset. Click on the active substance name beside the substance icon and you can view the table of contents. The table of contents can be expanded to view the studies in the dataset. The studies are reported in OECD harmonized templates. To view the study expand the sections in the left-hand table of contents until you see the sections with an orange circle. Click on these sections to view or edit a document. If you already have a substance dataset the relevant studies will already be included in the table of contents. Euclid allows the reuse of studies in different working contexts. If you would like to amend the template, you can open each of the sections and fill in with information. It is also possible to attach a full study report and its sanitized version to the template. You can use FSCAP to create a dossier for submission. To do this, you have to pick the food domain, the authorization type and the application type. This selection provides a unique link to the template for the table of contents of the dossier and the process that this dossier will follow when submitted. The template tables of contents have been co-designed by EFSA and DG Sonte to ensure that all information required by legislation is included in the dossier. At this point of the application you will be required to add data or attach documents for each heading in the table of contents. When uploading files, you can indicate if you wish to request confidentiality treatment. When doing so, you will need to provide a detailed justification. Once the dossier is submitted, it will be forwarded to EFSA for completeness checking, risk assessment and confidentiality assessment.